Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome back to the basement on this day where I am recovering. Not why you may think, oh, short, short about, oh, my day yesterday started great. Graduation party for a niece, went out to celebrate the best friend's birthday. We were on a hot tub boat on Lake Union. Drinks, laughter, great time. Then I got home to no internet. Cause I'm moving, you know I'm moving and Xfinity messed up move dates and whatnot and it took four and a half hours because heaven forbid you get to speak to a live person that when i finally cried and i said cancel it all they finally got me a live person and she fixed it in five minutes so xfinity and if i had another option i would totally go with them but i'm here finally because now i have internet and i can finish off the season two season two finale of lucifer so, according to the Sumerian book, uh, Amenadiel is God's favorite son and left him the key to put together the blade that can smite God, open the gates of heaven. What other uses does this flaming blade have? I don't know. I guess we'll find out because the goddess has been stabbed and her light makes you melt people and stuff's happening and I want to know what happens next and I know you want me to know what happens next. So we're going to get to it. I've got the blanket. I got a glass of wine because it's early yet and I still have shit to do. <laughs> but I hope you have your favorite beverage and that you remember a full episode watch along is available on Patreon where I love to see you all there and we are going to get to it. Well, we're picking up exactly where we left off. Look at those shoes. Look at those shoes. She's stapling herself back together. Wow. I guess she didn't have crazy glue on hand. I've seen people do that for like cuts on their hands, like little paper cuts. Hello, it's Charlotte Richards. I need a favor. Who's she calling? Who can she call that will answer the name Charlotte Richards and come help her? Would you look at that, Lucy? It really is the final piece. I'm God's favorite son. Hanging the final piece of the flaming sword right under our nose. It, well, your nose this entire time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy I'm God's favorite son. <laughs> at least we have it now. Sorry. Well, hand it over, brother. The sword's not gonna ignite itself. Give it to me. Right, don't be silly, brother. You know, I'm ten times stronger than you. But I'm the favorite. This is the most happiest we've seen him. Don't make me hurt you. Remember, you're not the angel you once were. <sighs> yeah. Ooh. 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 I think I've got E.T. on the DVR if you need a good weep and a pint of hagen in the freezer, if that helps. Did he take the sword with him? I missed it. I, mi I blinked it. I missed it. She's still coming into work. She's still coming into work. God. Goddess. I need medical attention. Then go to a hospital. This isn't exactly a human injury. I would appreciate it if you would just patch me up. I am a doctor, but patching people up isn't my thing. Physi physically, mentally, she's all about patching people up. It is. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I suppose I could take a gander. Just don't look directly at it. Don't melt your face, Linda. I should warn you, you might have to. <laughs> oh! that to you i mean was it lucifer not on purpose you know accidentally okay duct tape good for everything trust me this stuff's amazing why does she have duct tape in her office at work <laughs> when she tape it together i'm just self-aware today no i meant dan anyway tell me how do you stop them from is this the pregnancy hide? This coat looks like a pregnancy Imagine. hide. Leave it to him to turn a coat. And the arm across the belly. 
I mean, he should be happy he's dad's favorite. Wait, your dad didn't actually tell you guys that, did he? So many Sumerian words, yes. Body dump. Weird one, too. And not just because of the obvious buck, naked, deep fried head thing, but someone also shaved this poor guy's this entire jet? body. If anyone can find something, it's you. Oh, that is so sweet. Yes, well, until you do, I've got some perfect. What was on your gloves, Ella, that you're now handling, <laughs> hugging people with? She's wearing gloves, right? Doctor. Hi, Lucifer. I'm wondering if you've seen a Menadil. Nope. Haven't seen that family member. No. Well, you stop being weird and just let me in. What are you doing here? Girl stuff. Naked girl stuff. Dr. Linda, I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh. <laughs> Mum, if your powers are returning to this degree, then your human body won't be able to contain it. You're... You're burst. Amenadil has the missing piece of the sword. Yuki, son, why didn't you say something? I think an opportunity. May have already harmed someone. Oh, no, no, I just came from a crime scene. The man with the burned head. Please tell me that isn't Chet. Because if we don't get you back to heaven before the detective gets to you, then she is quite literally toast. Okay, my, my question has always been, where are the gates of heaven? Are they down on the street corner? Are they up in the sky? Are they at the bottom of the ocean? Where are the gates? Did you sleep on a banana peel too? What? I'm afraid you're gonna need surgery. <laughs> Don't fight it, the kid's fierce. Uh. So I left mum in the wine cellar at Lux What? He's just saying this right in front of Trixie. Okay. But I need you to find a menadil. Then we can get the pendant, assemble the sword before mum spews light everywhere. You don't have to speak in code. I can handle adult stuff. Many humans could get hurt. Yeah, and? Oh, nice try, Maze. But I happen to know there's a few that you care about. <laughs> Would you pay me my standard fee? No freebies. Absolutely. Oh, love me a lolly. Sorry, wussies don't get any. And it came back as your brother, Chet. Can you think of anyone who may have wanted your brother dead? I'm thinking there's a list. That's why I left to get away from him. Ruiz Empire. I know you were the one who put my mother in prison. I also know you were after Chet, so I know what you think of my family. Look, I'm gonna work this case as carefully and fairly as I would any other case. I promise you. Oh, oopsie daisy. Lose over! Please tell me you have something. No, no, nothing. It's so frustrating. Well, there is one thing I'm waiting on. So, the tech team is checking the vicinity for cameras, but it's such a remote place, so... Sadly, the only witness to this one is my dear old dad. Your dad is always watching. Wait a second. That gives me an idea. It does. Satellite imaging takes sporadic photos of, well, everything. Oh. <laughs> so there may be footage of the killer going to or from the warehouse. Exactly. Thanks, Lucifer. <laughs> You're so welcome. <laughs> It's me. God chose me. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. He's at improv. This whole time, I actually thought that God had lost he... faith in me, but it was me. I lost faith in him. I can see that now. He's at improv. That losing my powers must have been a test. He's at improv. I'm so sorry, Father. Yes, and how was your poor chop? <laughs> That's great. We'll cut right there. Hey. Wait, 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 wait. Dan is running the improv group? Dan, what? But there are a few subjects that we try to- What? Avoid. You know, religion, politics, anything too polarizing. Totally understand. I got this. Perfect. Dan's running the improv group. Give him another scenario. Uh, zookeepers and the giraffe is pregnant. Action. I think she's going into labor. How could I help when I was supposed to kill my own father? And cut. <clears throat> It's a little dark, buddy. Aaron, just try to have fun with it. 
But I thought you told me this helped you work through difficult personal matters. I did. Oh, you did. You did. <laughs> APB got a hit that it was parked in the lot across the street. No, I'm telling you, we're wasting time. But how do you know this park van's even the same one? I mean, there's no license plates on this image. Yeah, I got it. I got it. You still think we're wasting our time? I know this looks bad, oh, but no we can explain. We take care of crime scenes, dead body removals, all the icky stuff, but totally legit. Why is he in a heart attack? Oh, like two, two weeks, weeks ago. ago. Two <laughs> weeks ago. Why was your van outside of an abandoned warehouse in Eagle Rock at 3 a.m. last night? We were nowhere near that area. Wow. Do not tell me you went to see Brad again. I thought you were done with that trip. I was till I ran into him at Jamba Juice. Understand I... completely. I mean, what's more intoxicating than a mango a go go? Why are you still hiding things from me after all we've been through? You know, I don't lie, Detective. But you also don't tell the whole truth. You're gonna find this really freeing once you get the hang of it. And I'll help you through it. it just takes practice. Does Dan need a friend? Dan needs a friend. Oof. Well, you're strong. <laughs> <laughs> that family is so weird. Wow. You'll get the hang of it. Wow. It just takes four Wow. Days. Jeez, you went quick. Time to assemble the sword, Amenadio. I don't know that I want to. The father entrusted me with the final piece. That changes things. Ha 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 ha. You see, I thought I had fallen, and I... I don't get paid by the hour. <laughs> I was gonna ask, how she keeping up? Why are they at the Paris Hotel? Can I be your travel buddy? I love Paris. This is the Paris Hotel in Vegas, actually. Oh, not going there. It's fine. Still best baguette sandwich ever was at the cafe. If it's still the same. Hello, brother. <laughs> I notice you've changed your look. Where's your pretty necklace? Oh, I put it in a safe place. Ah, oh, keister it, did you? No. Nope. Already checked. Not there. <laughs> right. So you and mom can slice through the gates of heaven and destroy father. Yeah, I know. Oh, now that he's dad's favorite son, he's gonna protect dad. Oh. That necklace was a gift. It's not some manipulation. Well, you only think that because it was gifted to you. No! And I strongly believe that I am to guard that peace. Now, I may have lost my way, but that doesn't mean that I can't rectify things now. And rectify them how, sir? I was just going to kick mum into heaven and slam the gates behind her. Let the two lovebirds torture each other for eternity. And that's better. Yes. No. Yes. Mum's powers are returning, and it won't be long before we can't contain them. Mum has to go. She already has. Ah, where did she go? Your mother's gone. Where did she go? First of all, something or other. It's valuable, so... Must be good. Ooh, goddess, what is your plan? When you first saw my wound, you asked if Lucifer had done it. What did you mean by that? <laughs> Meaningless brain fart, you know, <laughs> just blah. I don't think so. This height deal that they're playing up on is fascinating. I don't want to hurt you, Linda. I am running. Tell me what you know over a glass of wine or over your own charbroiled corpse. Your choice. I came here to grill Kathleen on the false alibi. Whoa. Oh no. What? It's Ava Lyon. What? What? That hired the Lyon sisters to clean up, then cleaned up the cleaner. Ava! <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> what? Ava knew nothing about it. I wasn't lying about Brad. And he needed money. Then I got 
this call offering me a hundred grand. That's a decent amount of money. Who hired you? Who killed Chet and your sister? I have her sister Kathleen here, but she's not saying anything. She's scared, so I need you to come here do and thing. I need you to do your mojo thing. Believe me when I say I want to find the killer as much as you do. Hello, boys. Ta da! I I've got a rush. I've good luck with Kathleen. Ciao. Damn it. Did she kill Ava? Maybe he's not hiding something from me, but someone, someone who knew Chet. And someone I still don't trust. The good news is you found a meta deal. We have the keys. Right. Well, uh, upon careful consideration, we've decided this whole flaming sword plan is a crap idea. Yes, crap. Mm. <laughs> have you ever considered finding, well, I don't know, a, pl a place of your own? Somewhere familiar? Warmer, perhaps? Warmer. <laughs> You want me back in hell? Well, not in hell, per se, but in charge of hell. I mean, after all, it is a kingdom without a ruler. In charge of hell. Great opportunity for upward mobility. You are working against me. Oh, no. You never planned on going with me to heaven. Well, Amenadil did. How did you find out? I persuaded him. Your little doctor. What did you do? You're angry. <gasps> I'm not angry. She's disappointed She's and crushed. Disappointed. <laughs> Wait, we just broke the piano, didn't we? <laughs> I'm a little tired and I didn't figure it in. You're gonna have to kill me. <gasps> Guess I'll have to find another way, won't I? Well, she's going after everybody. Well, now look what you've made her do. I've just had this tombs. How about you suggesting hell as a retirement home? Nice. Maybe if you had just mentioned the pottery class or water aerobics, <laughs> she would have gone for it. Mom's coming undone. I know, and she doesn't care if she hurts anymore. Linda. Linda. Check on Linda. You go after mom. She'll listen to you. Yes. She's she's listening to Lucifer right now. Obviously. Santa Monica. What's in Santa Monica? What's in Santa Monica? <gasps> well, well, someone's clever. Did little Miss Dandelion tell you? It's over, Charlotte. Put your hands up. I'll tell you everything you want to know. I just have one small request. Detective, uh, any chance you've seen my mom? Looking for little old me? You were right, dear. Your detective is quite good. Start talking. Just the two of us. I'd rather not put Daniel in Harm's an awkward position. Hate to ruin all the good ones we've been in. <laughs> I'll be fine. <gasps> One last time. <laughs> I miss you, Daniel. You were my favorite human. Linda, you here? Be on our way. <gasps> no, no, no! She fried Linda. <laughs> she fried Linda. It's okay, I'm here. Okay. You're oh, Linda. Oh, Linda! She wanted to know what Lucifer's plans were. I didn't want to tell her. I tried to resist. I'm so sorry. It's not your fault. Okay, and you're going to be fine. I promise. I'm, I'm gonna fix you. She heard Linda, motherfuckers! Hello, Daniel. Whoa! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> God. Oh my God! No, don't be silly. I'm not going to stab you. I'm just looking for something. Come on, up, up. Looking for something. Oh. You thinking that. Oh. Uh, the hug. I was involved in Chet's death, but not in the way you think. Well, correct me if I'm wrong. You killed him. You hired a cleaner to take care of the body, and then you killed the cleaner. Is that it? 
The cleaner's dead? I certainly had nothing to do with that. Mom! I've got it! Now let the detective go. Okay. Have the blade and the final piece. You let the detective go and they are yours. People, go away. Run away. You see there is a no, potentially violent situation. Go. Oh, I think we found our mystery killer. It's the brother. He's so clip. It's the brother. I need a hospital. It's too far, Alex. She won't make it. So what's your suggestion? We need more time. We just need more time. What are you doing? Slowing time. Please just put the gun down. No! <gasps> oh. Oh, so when Aminadil slows time, he slows time everywhere, not just the vicinity? Aminadil, son of a bitch. How? He has faith in himself, right? <gasps> oh. <laughs> Ow. So what are you going to do with it now, Lucifer? Sorry, Mom. <gasps> strike down your mother? But I'm afraid that this ends now. Is he going to strike down his mother? You've hurt so many people, Mom. It has to stop. What about your father? He created Chloe just to manipulate you. We have the sword. Finally. Finally, we can get revenge. We can take our home back. I'm not leaving, Mom! Give me the sword. And I'll do the rest. Is he gonna destroy it? Is he gonna destroy it? I just want a chance to start over. Going home? That's not starting over. It's going backwards. And that's not good for anyone. So it's time for you to move forwards, Mom. Which means what? I wonder. Even if it means I'll never see you again. No! Is that the gate to heaven or the gate to hell? What is that? It's, it's nothing. At least for now. Wait, he opened a portal to nothing? This is the real way to move forward, Mum. To create a whole new world, your own world, without Father. What about you? You know that if we go back to heaven, then there will be a war. And in war, there are always casualties. Like Chet. So please, let there be light. <laughs> Kick her through the portal, she hurt Linda. The no retreat, I will tear down every Charlotte lies there dead with a wound, a blade wound in her gut. <laughs> and Lucifer just had a sword in his hand. Oh no. Fire in the dark when you sound the alarm. I'm sorry, Daniel, she didn't. <laughs> What? What? Mom? Mom. What's, what's going on? She remembering being stepped in the batch. Back? Who are you? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So what do you think will happen to Charlotte? I think she's going to spend some time in a mental health clinic. Well, you think he killed his own brother? I think he would be the first to agree. You know, things between families can get pretty heated. <laughs> oh, and Ella found a Mondo blowtorch in Hector's car, so there's that. Because at this point, you either trust me or you don't. Detective, I trust you. Look, if you think that I wouldn't forgive you, if you think that I don't know who you really are by now, you're wrong. I'm okay. 
This is my fault, and... Lucifer, I walked into this with my eyes wide open. Chose to be your friend and face all that comes with you. The good, the bad, and the crispy. I just realized something that I need to do. Detective, hello, it's me. Hello, it's me. <laughs> she wouldn't know by hello, detective. But I also wanted to say that I am done hiding. So I'm coming over now to tell you the truth about me. I want to tell you everything. I have a feeling he's not going to get a chance to. No more going backwards. No one is coming now. We have to end on a cliffhanger. So the cliffhanger must be he doesn't get a chance to. So somewhere along the way, he gets kidnapped and beaten to a pulp. And burnt and flayed and. The world's And he has his wings back. Well, that's a hell of a cliffhanger. So I'm thinking there was a key phrase there. No sense going backwards. But he's on sand in the sun with his wings flayed like as if he had just fallen. Right. So are we going back to when he fell the first time, which doesn't make sense because he's been around for millennia and he's got on his black slacks somewhere along the way. He was kidnapped by something and went through hell. Is that the last we see of the goddess? Question mark, question mark. She got off very easily, but I can see why. I, I did not expect Linda being wounded. Oh my gosh. Rachel Harris. Oh my God. Broke my heart when Mays picks her up and she just starts crying. Oh my God. That was terrible. I'm, I'm, oh, 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 mm, justice for Linda. So I guess essentially the mom goddess story arc has ended. Amenadale is getting some of his powers back. Are we going to see him with wings in season three? When is Chloe going to find out the truth? The truth. Will Dan find out the truth? The Dan Amenadale bromance. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> the whole improv thing. But sneaking the thing into Dan's pocket. That was slick. That was slick. And we still need justice for Linda. <laughs> you know what I mean? She needs to do well. I need her to do well and be well in the future. I'm upset about that still. So we have a new mystery to come and I'm excited. Okay, so there was the end of season two. Thank you so much for being with me with some of like really good episodes. The Lucifer taking on Dan Persona. <laughs> God Johnson, Mays and Chloe at the school. There was just some good moments this season. Oh, the night, the girls night out was great. Yeah, good moments of the series. And I'm so glad you were there with me. So I can't wait to share more. So please hit subscribe if you haven't already. So you know when the next one drops in the queue. And as always, this is just a reminder to go eat. If you haven't already, says the girl who's just eat nothing but M&Ms all day because I am mentally wiped. But go eat something substantial. I'm going to go find some protein. You're going to stretch and then you're going to come back and watch the next video in the queue. So thanks again, y'all. And until next time.